official and unbeatable feeling of match day is in the air and the knowledge that this has all the makings of a vibrant and compelling encounter. Anticipation levels are sky high and every expectation this game will live up to its billing. All the action coming up on EA TV. Hello and welcome to the south coast of England. We're here at the Amex Stadium. My name is Derek Ray and ready with his tactics board to provide all the analysis is Stuart Robson. I'm very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It's Brighton and Hove Albion versus Arsenal. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. And a look at the lineup for Brighton. Well, they're starting with an attacking 4 5 1 formation with three players in advance and two holding midfielders. But it's important that the wide players come in field to join the centre forward at the right time. And a look at the starting lineup for Arsenal. Kai Havertz starts, could be in. So a tidy finish. That's a nice goal. So underway again here. One nil to score. to an end the first half here at the Amex Stadium. And Martin Odegaard. Away they go again. The second half is underway here. Bad challenge. And now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. And it is going to be a yellow card. And I can't imagine he's too surprised. 
know he was always going to get a book in there. He's been warned. That's a good ball. Possession ceded by Brighton. Jesus. Arsenal move it forward with purpose and control. But nothing comes of it. Now oh, breaking at pace is always a possibility. Gilmore. It's with Welbeck. A good run this. Now oh, what can he do with it? They do pass the ball with authority. Well, honestly, I didn't mean to jinx them. This wasn't a very good pass, finally. 30 minutes to go, then. Marcinelli. Gabriel Jesus prepared to fire. And it still could be dangerous. He went it well defensively. on this occasion options in the middle and well bent and a goal he's doubled his total for the day in superb scoring form well as you can see his movement is really good which then makes the finish look easy. That's a decent goal, that's for sure. So underway again, and a 2-0 advantage here. Gabriel. Now with Havertz. Martinelli. Havertz. Declan Rice. And return to Jesus. say that's a brilliant finish he wraps his foot around the ball and curls it brilliantly I'm not sure the keeper could do anything about that It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Bukayo Saka. So two minutes to be added on at the end. This is looking threatening. But the fans really want him to shoot. Terrific save.
Who's going to get on the end of it? No nonsense piece of defending. Welbeck. Welbeck! Brilliant save. And there goes the final whistle. We can call this a Seagulls success story. Three points for Brighton. How would you sum it up? Well, it was a very assured performance, wasn't it? I was particularly impressed with their play going forward. Really lively, almost cutting through at will at times. The result was never much in doubt, if I'm honest.